And can Devin O'Connell track down the 76? A Dana DiMatteo. They hustle down the backstretch. DiMatteo still in command. Two turns away from victory. Off the turn, Devin O'Connell has reeled him in, but not enough as the checkered flag is out. And Dana DiMatteo will take down the win. Devin O'Connell will finish in second. Oh my God, I've been waiting so long for this. It's been a while. Um, just got to thank uh, Island Cove Marina, Manafort Brothers, j, &J Racing, uh, FK Rod Ends, Papa's Dodge in New Britain, uh, Jags Tires, Waddell Communications, 600 Engine Shop, Sign Pro, DCI, um, Joey Muchacharo, Frank Muchacharo, all my family for coming out tonight. Uh, I just got to thank everybody, man. And there is the white flag, one more circuit around. Marcello Raffano came so close just a week ago. He heads down the back straightaway for his final visit. This will be his first career victory, deep in a turn number three. Marcello Raffano, the Mr. Rooter machine, the Wheeler's automotive car. Marcello Raffano has done it. He will take down the win. Zach Robinson to finish in the second spot. And rounding up the top three will be Tyler Trott. You know, this is a way overdue win. These last couple of weeks, you know, the last lap, I was looking in that mirror too much. Before we went on the race, my buddy CJ, he put a sticker up. He goes, look ahead. I didn't look back once. I just drove my line. I had an amazing car. I had a great setup. Right before we went on the track, quarter out on the toe. Fixed that up, came out. Victory lane, baby. It is do or die time for Justin Brent as he tries to erase the deficit that separates him from Albert Saunders. And Saunders is able to cannonball his way into turn number three with a healthy lead over Brent. They come off turn number four, lapped automobile. Ladies and gentlemen, double checkers are out. Albert Saunders has done it. Brent in for second. And a great run for Paul Arut to finish in the third spot. Yeah, thanks. Uh, Barry got another awesome setup in the car for tonight. Uh, the car was really good. He made some great changes after practice. So uh, I was off to uh, kind of a rough start the last couple weeks. So it's pretty good to get uh, second last week and another win this week. So uh, it's really cool. Car was awesome. White flag is out and there's no surrendering at the point. Charlan and Peyton Henry also battling for third and fourth. Back down the back straightaway, final time. Kopsik still trying to hold on. Beaujolais is there, Matt. Turn three. Beaujolais trying to make a move. Kopchik protecting the lead. They will move off a of turn four. And it is Kopchik who holds off Beaujolais to get a breathtaking win. Oh yeah, that was awesome. That was a really good race with Beaujolais. And it's nice to see he's got a fast car and he's he's really fun to race with when he's, when he's right there. Um, uh, this is awesome. We, first win of the year. My crew really deserved it. We've been struggling the last 12 or 13 races. I don't know, but it's just well deserved by everyone, especially my dad just working late nights on the car and just everyone who puts in to get us where we are right now. White flag is out. Will this be a coronation for Ryan Priest? Ryan Priest heads down the back straightaway like days of old. Priest is back at winning form here at Stafford into turn number three. Ryan Priest has done it with back-to-back -back victories. The checkered flag is out, and Ryan Priest will take down the impressive win. Yeah, it's uh, it's owed all the Mike, my crew, Mike Paquette. You know, he, me and him were setting the car up on Thursday nights, and. You know, we have a lot of fun doing it. And, and you know, this whole team, it's a real close-knit bunch of guys. And, you know, my father and, and Mike German and uh, John and Don, my girlfriend's father, my girlfriend here for supporting me. You know, uh, this car was real good tonight, and it's only going to get better. I'm real happy with these guys. White flag is out for Michael Bennett. Ricard moved up to the third spot, and Tommy Butler moved in fourth as Joshua Wood dropped back to the sixth position. Deep into turn number three, and off the fourth turn, they come back to the line. Ladies and gentlemen, the double checkers are out, and Michael Bennett has secured his fifth victory of 2015. Yeah, it was a, it was a hard place to start. You know, back in eighth, we were a little bit nervous there. Things worked out in our favor. Um, 
Had a crazy long week. Uh, last Saturday, my, my daughter was born. <coughs> so uh, she's here. Well, she's not here tonight. My wife's home with her, uh, watching this on Periscope. And uh, so I, gotta, I wish they were both here, but hey, we got one for her. 